Today we would like to show the integration of the Profinet I.O. Link Master IOLG2PN from SIG into a Siemens TIA Portal PLC environment. First of all, the device is renamed by clicking on Online Access and selecting the Computer's Interface Access card. Then, the search for accessible devices is performed. At the lower end of the screen, a process bar is visible. The I.O. Link Master is now displayed. By clicking on Online Diagnosis, the master is diagnosed and by clicking on Functions, a name can be assigned. In this example, the master is renamed to SIGPN. By clicking on Assign Name, the name is assigned to the I.O. Link Master. In the lower information bar, a confirmation is displayed. When performing a new search, the I.O. Link Master appears with a new name. The next step is the installation of the GSD file. The GSD file can be downloaded from zig.com. By clicking on Options, Install General Station Description, the GSD file can be installed. Only after installing the GSD file, it is possible to configure the Profinet device. The existing Profinet network is displayed by clicking on Device Configuration, Network View. And the I.O. Link Master is displayed in the hardware catalog under Other Field Devices, Profinet I.O., I.O., SIG AG, SIG IOL. The master can now be added by drag and drop into the left window. To link the device with a Profinet controller, it is necessary to create a connection between controller and device, which is the easiest to do by drag and drop again. The next step is to switch the device view by double-clicking on the device. The device communication is now being configured by clicking on Properties. The Ethernet interface menu allows defining the IP address. In this example, the 1055 is used. It is important that the address belongs to the PLC's IP range. The next important step is the Profinet name. The Profinet controller assigns an IP address via the device's name. In this field, the name that has been determined before will be entered. In this example, it is SIGPN. The next step is the configuration of the I.O. Link ports. On port 1, a ZIG sensor is connected. In this example, the standard I.O. module is deleted and replaced by an I.O. Link module. As the connected sensor has a bit length of 2 byte, a 2 byte module is selected. For process data access, the PLC's I.O. addresses can be configured in this field. Next step is to configure which port shall have an I.O. link communication. The head module is accessed, then module parameters and for port 0 the option I.O. link is selected. As soon as this has been done, the project is compiled and then transferred to the PLC. After selecting the communication interfaces, the program is downloaded to the PLC. After a successful download, the PLC is rebooted. The Go Online button allows seeing the online status of the PLC and its periphery. By clicking on Distributed IOs, Profinet IO Systems, the green symbol shows that there is an established connection with the PLC. The next step we would like to show in this tutorial is the communication with the integrated web server. Just enter the IP address that has been assigned to the IO Link Master into your browser and you will enter the integrated web server. Make sure the proxy server has been deactivated when using this feature. The device can be diagnosed from here as well. The Diagnostic Module view shows the current status of the module. The picture represents the actual status of the module itself. Here, connections and errors are displayed. To access process data, the Diagnostic Process tab has to be opened. The connected device is displayed. 
As soon as the process data change, the web server visualizes these changes immediately. By clicking on Device Properties, service data of the IO-Link device can be read or written down. As an example, the standard index 16 is displayed. This index is the vendor name of the connected device. By read index 16, the IO-Link master reads the data and visualizes it as an ASCII-based hex stream. In this case, the displayed name is SIG-AG. For more information, visit us at sig.com.